The 12th of August, um, I was doing my shift as usual. A lot of the time while we're on patrol, it's really quiet here. Things can turn to absolute chaos just in a very short amount of time. Uh, we got a call that uh, pilot wheels were seen uh, and that they're probably gonna, gonna be uh, a grind on the Sande Vagur. So uh, we checked out the police station, we saw them move, we knew what was on. So we immediately rushed to the beach to try and get there. And we could see the boats driving in. We could see the black fins and the sensation was really awful because it's something you never want to see. At that point, we saw a boat and we realized it was one of our boats. The pod was fighting very hard to escape and the Sea Shepherd boat was fighting very hard um, to help get them back out to sea. There was a point where I saw the pod head straight for the open ocean and they actually they gained a few meters and it really looked like they had the chance. At that point a little sparkle of hope that they could escape was still on. Our boat was only one boat against uh, their boats. At some point they had to escape, so the boat had no choice but to go to the shore. The moment the Echo left, we decided to make a run for the water. We had one small boat, five bodies against uh, 500 people on the beach, 50 boats pushing. So it was a lost battle, but there's no reason not to fight. They dragged us to the side, I saw the other ones already sitting there. They said that uh, they seated us together and, uh, well, we wait and we had to watch. We were facing the water, so, and, uh, yeah, we watched what we tried to prevent. But, uh, I wasn't scared there because I had clear in my mind what, why I was there. What really scares me is seeing something unfair, unjust and doing nothing to change it. That really scares me. The whalers there have to realize that even if they deport me or one of the others, another one will come and another hundred will come. So we will never stop. We're much stronger than they are. 
So, as a movement, they've got no chance against us.